Spiller. Passes it to Webster. Here's the three. The clock runs out, and we're heading to halftime. It's the Wizards. They lead by 13. And time now to go courtside as we send you over to Doris Burke from the sideline. Doris? Hey, Kevin, I've got Joe, and you started out with a great first half and seem to have that extra boost in your game tonight. Okay, eyes up front, guys. Our fans are really liking what we've done so far. Well, we're getting back to the action now. It's been a one-team show so far. Wake up, son. Kevin Sheriff, and he's checked in for Gortat. Humphreys comes in for Nene. Artel Webster, he's checked in for Pierce. And Andre Miller is subbed in for Rasul Butler. And a new group in for the Nets. Brandon Davies is checked in for Plumlee. Mirza Cholinovich comes in for Kevin Garnett. Bogdanovich is checked in for Anderson. And Jared Jack has subbed in for Brown. So for Brooklyn now, we've got Mirza Cholinovich. Johnson is out there with Jared Jack. Then there's Brandon Davies. And it's Bogdanovich. Nene, he's checked in for the Wizards. Williams comes in for John Wall. Well, a lot of tough teams in this league. Here's where Brooklyn sits right now. Eighth and lowest turnovers per game. Ninth in free throw percentage. And they're in the top half of the league when it comes to limiting opponents' offense as well. Now, they're a smart team. You talked about those few turnovers, and that's the number that really stands out to me when you go down that list of stats. Uh, they're smart. They don't take a lot of crazy gambles. They try to work the ball around the perimeter, get it inside when they can, and get the best shot every time down the floor. Guys, he shot a very good percentage today, and they've needed it. Washington leading now by seven. Miller with the ball. Right now averaging five points a game. And another miss by Washington. They've been able to get out to this lead without really getting a very reliable performance out of him from the field. Here's Bogdanovich. And Zoletovich kicks to Jack. Nice ball movement by Brooklyn. Pass to Johnson. 156 left in the third quarter. Shot clock at five. Second shot opportunity. This is Joe Johnson is also sometimes called ISO Joe because of his ability to produce buckets going one on one. There's nobody better in that situation in terms of creating a shot with ease and never shying away from the big moment. Let's look at the energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for the Wizards. Boy, their hounding, harassing effort at the defensive end, very impressive. And they forced quite a few turnovers as a result. And I love their hustle because they're getting a lot of second chance opportunities just as a result of playing hard. Good on the second free throw. Tremendous output from Johnson. He's got 19 points, and he's made some good decisions with the basketball, too. Well, being smart is, is what it's all about for him, Clark. I mean, he's a decision maker. He's a playmaker. He has to make good decisions. That's what he's doing here so far. Nene kicks to Miller. Outside Williams. Dishes to Webster. Let's it go with a three. And rebounded by Davies. And you talk about Johnson's ability to get his shot on 6-7, huge frame for a two-guard. And with his ball handling ability, he can really create space for himself. The kick out to Jack. Right side Jack. Let's a floater go. Knocked loose. 
Toledovich passes to Davies. Johnson with it. Williams picks him up. Pass to Bogdanovich. 51 seconds left in the third. And again, no good by Brooklyn. And Johnson so smooth, Clark, but, but you know, Joe, his size and strength, sometimes it seems like he could do more to press the issue and draw foul. Well, you know, I'm not going to be overly critical. This guy is terrific as a one-on-one -on -one isolation player. He used to average over five free throws a game, but that number has declined. But that may be more a function of him maturing in his career and picking his spots to be aggressive than not wanting to draw contact. And Jack kicks to Bogdanovich. Feeds it to Davis. Can't get it to go. Now Washington takes it the other way. They'll be hosting Orlando for the next one. That'll be the latter half of this two-game homestand. And the pass to Webster. 11 seconds left to play in the third. Nene with the screen on Jack. Off the pick. Shots good by Williams. Williams has got 12 in the game. Great job of utilizing that screen and finding space to knock down the jumper. Good basketball. And offensively, a great show for the fans through the first three quarters. It's been a fun game to watch. Wizards lead by nine and will return shortly. And a moment here to look back at our State Farm assist of the game. Well, no question, this was going to be the winner. Just take a look at the expertise he showed. Perfectly timed and beautifully placed. Now here's Wall. Williams in a two guard. Pierce out there with Bertot. Then it's Rasul Buck and it's Wall in at the point guard. That's the group on the floor right now for Washington. Johnson dishes the jab. to Garnett. Good, and Jack gets the assist. And that's 10 points for Garnett. Wizards leading by seven. Williams sets a screen for Wall. Plays it up, and despite of the excellent defense at that. Boy, this guy just plays with a love of the game. You can see it, how he prepares, his work ethic, the way he interacts with his teammates. Uh, when he hits the floor, it is all basketball. And for Brooklyn, they're shooting 49% on the game. They'll take that. And Jack, here we go. That's good. Two points. Jared Jack. Fourth quarter just getting started. One minute in the books. Ball gets a screen from Williams. Ball against Johnson. Three-pointer. Wall missing again. Oh, that's got to be deflating and disappointing to miss a wide-open shot like that right in your wheelhouse. Kept alive. That's what they call the million-dollar move with the 10-cent finish. Final quarter of play, about a minute and a half off the clock into it. The dish to Williams. And dead on that time. Beautiful shot. And the Wizards lead by nine. Great pass. John Wall is really good at finding the open man. Jack passes to Anderson. Garnett with a screen on Buck. Anderson against Buck. Lock at six. A nice shot by Anderson. Good defense, but you gotta love the finish with the finger roll over the top. Wizards leading by seven. Wall kicks to Pierce. That's good. No matter what they've tried, the D just has not been able to deny them the ball in the paint. That's been so critical, Clark, because whenever they have gotten the ball into the paint, it's resulted in points, it seems like. And it's Garnett at the elbow. Jack with a screen for Garnett. Shoots off the screen. Offensive rebound. 
Here's Plumley, and he drops in the way up off the glass. You know, when the size advantage is that pronounced, I mean, that's exactly what you should do offensively in this situation. Take it strong to the middle. Wall gets a screen from Williams. Wall dishes to Williams. Butler passes to Williams. Shot clock at six. And Wall. Here we go now. And that one's good. Well, since we hit half number two, he's finally come around. The first half was not his best, obviously. Nets trail. By nine. And Jack kicks to Anderson. Into Johnson. Williams with the block. Jack against Butler. Outside Williams. Gortat inside. Rebound Brooklyn. Plumley's got six rebounds now in the game. Johnson dishes to Jack. Kicks it to Anderson. Back to Jack. Goes up to the stripe. Rebound Washington. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Williams against Anderson. Puts up a three. Williams can't hit. Couldn't convert, but nice little two-man game there. And it wouldn't surprise me to see them go back to that the next trip. And Jack kicks to Johnson. And a great assist by Jack as that one goes in. Jack's got three assists tonight. He's done a ton to help his team, guys, and he may have to do more if they're going to come back and win. It's Wall with the drop. Johnson against Williams. Back to Wall. Williams, a screen on Jack. Three-pointer, Butler, and the basket good. And the Wizards lead by 10. He's not going to miss many of those, if any. Not when he's got that much room. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Sure could, Kev. I mean, too many empty trips. They need some points. Williams with the block. They retain possession. A nice shot by Anderson. Boy, they're doing a nice job, a really good job of getting second chances here. And that's a, that's a great way to cut into that lead. I mean, nothing is more. And so it's the Wizards with the W. They came, they saw, they conquered. Hey, Kevin, to me, any win is a good win. And that about wraps it up for Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, and Doris Burke. This is Kevin Harlan thanking you for watching the NBA presented by 2K Sports. And now, Jordan presents our player of the game, The Prodigy.